20 meters apart. Take his permission. Huh? Yeah. Yes, you can race down. <laughs> now, I'm going to talk about how light uses the path of least action. So, the path of least action is basically the path that takes the least time and has the least distance. So, if we have two points, let's say these two points are 10 units away from each other, let's say 10 meters, to make it a little more familiar. And let's say it's three meters to the ground. Well, actually, no. Uh, let's say it's 20 meters between the two of them, and it's, I don't know, uh, what unit should I use? I don't know, six meters. And this is also going to be six meters. So I'm going to draw three paths, and let's see which one light will actually take. So this path first, it might take this path second. So let's do that again. Oh, let's do that again. There we go. And then this path third. Okay. So I'm going to label, I don't know, how am I going to label this when all the colors are black? I'm going to say this one is A, this one is B, and this one is C. All right. So uh, I know this definitely looks confusing, so just take a minute to process this image. But which one uh, is light going to take? B, A, or C? A? Anyone thinks B or C? Anyone thinks B or C? Okay, has everyone settled on A? Not yet? Okay. You guys think it's A, B, or C? All three are not the same. Which one will I take? Okay, so let's draw the paths because uh, you guys are probably getting confused. So A is going to be this one, B is going to be this one, and C is going to be this one. Which one do you think light is going to take? A, B, or C? What have we learned about stuff, guys? A? Have you all set them on A? Okay. I hurry up. So the answer is indeed A, which should be pretty obvious because just from eyeballing it, you can see theta i is equal to theta r, while here theta i is clearly way less than theta r. Here theta i is way more than theta r. Doesn't line up. So that's A, B, and C. Now which are, so which one has the least distance? Which one takes the least distance? Shout out your answers. It's just a single letter. I know you guys can do it. B? Okay. Well, the answer is it's neither B nor C. Uh, it's also A. A is the shortest distance. You want me to prove that? So be it. So let's draw the thing again. We have uh, six. 20 meters apart. Huh? Yes, you can race that. <laughs> okay. So. 